When was the last time you were in a real relationship? Oh, uh, it's been a long... Not since I've been out here. And you've been out here seven years? Yeah, yeah. Whoa. I seem to have like three month stints here and there. Mm -hmm. And then like, I don't know. I just never let it get past that. Have you ever gotten your heart broken? Uh, yeah. Well, I moved to LA. um, And then we were going to make it work. But as it turns out, he had a whole other girlfriend in Florida the whole time. And then got her pregnant the weekend I moved. There's been a couple times where I've tried to like... There's been a couple women that I've like really been into and like wanted to pursue something with and yeah. just didn't want to do it. I have like a world of trust issues that I'm trying not to like be that girl, but Yeah, I mean and, and they don't even really give a good reason, so I don't know. It's 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 tough. Do you think you're choosing unavailable guys? Yes. I've identified this. Like, I choose people that yeah. I, it's never going to work. It's like one guy was going to be moving back to New York in four, five months. So I was like, oh, I can't fall for you. And then, like, another guy, like, is terrible at texting me back. And I'm like, oh, like, you're not even that interested. So this is going to go well. Tell your partner what you like about them. Be very honest this time, saying things that you might not say to someone you've just met. Oh, shit. Sh I think you're very pretty. I usually don't say wow, that right away to somebody. <laughs> <laughs> I like your relationship with your mom. It seems very healthy. And that's like a telltale sign for like a lot of other things down the road. He seems like way too good for me. I think I would be very bad for him. <laughs> Falling in love with Leah Lamar